Here's a quick multiple choice. You have a friend that claims to have a converging lens that diverges light somehow. And uh, the question is, which of these has to be true, right? So one is bull. I mean, they're just wrong. There's no way you could ever have a converging lens that diverges light, but you can if you have the object in the right place or the light source in the right place, right? So if the focal length is set here and you put your object inside the focal length, remember how we draw the rays in that case, this one will go and this one will always go through the focus. This one will always go straight to the center of the lens and you can see those are starting to uh, diverge there. And then you can imagine a backwards ray. The one that came straight here would have to go there. So you can draw like that. So those are diverging rays. So a converging lens can diverge light if you put the source of the light or the object <coughs> really close to it. So this actually is not true. Although I would say this may not be a friend you should study with because it's a little weird. Um, next you could say F is positive. The focal length value of the lens is positive. Well, if your friend isn't lying to you, that has to be true. That's the definition of a converging lens. Could F be negative? No, because that's the definition of a diverging lens. So that can't be true. And then can A and B be true? No. Can't be true because, yes, you can make a diverging lens. So that's not true. Can A and C be true? Well, definitely not. The answer is simply B. The focal length of their converging lens is positive.